so, so, whoa, no, 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 no. I know, I know, it's unprotected. Unprotected. We're back vlogging. We're going to somewhere top secret. Hold on, I'm turning. Ah. Okay, so Anthony's gonna take me to dinner because I actually don't have a dinner spot planned, but I kind of have like an after dinner spot planned and it's super cute. And I think he knows where I'm taking him, but at the same time, like it literally could be anything. I could be playing and he doesn't know that. It so. could be you, but you're playing, girl. How did you know? I know. Yes. Oh yes. How did you know? I smelled it. I can read I you. can't believe that. He read guessed like where book, we're going. Bro. Halfway there. Read you like a book, bro. But like, how did you know, though? <laughs> um, okay, so I saw our buddy yeah. po post about it a few weeks ago. Two, yeah, like two weeks I saw ago. it. But how did you know I was going to take you to the pumpkin patch? I mean, we could have gone there too, I don't know. But then when I asked you, is it north or where is that? And you said north. Then I was almost 100% sure it was. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Get it, Mom. It's finally less than triple digits in Arizona, so. Take advantage. Take advantage folks. of it. Also, our first stop before we're going to the place that I want to take them, um, we're going to Coconuts. So, if you guys don't know what Coconuts is, it's. The world's number one fish taco. Yeah, he got a Taco Mountain. So we ordered and then went to CVS to get earplugs. And now, about to go in on this because I'm starving. Ooh. So this is my order. I got coconut shrimp. And then Anthony got the Taco Mountain. Holy deliciousness. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh, shiz, dog. Whoa, we're going on that. We're going on that. Hi. Uh, you're gonna go up to Jonathan right there, you'll take care of me. Okay, thank you. You guys, it's $60 to South Park. This is crazy. Awesome, did we purchase any tickets online? No, no we need no. to do that. Thank you. Thank you. Band. And these are ride um, Yeah, so that would be good for the admission and all the rides. Oh, cool. Thanks. You said Thank no you. on the receipt, correct? No thanks on the receipt. Right, let me go grab those other two. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Can you help me? Got it. Well, this is scary lighting. Come on. <laughs> Come on. You guys, this is the drink I ordered. Like, look how cute this is. Okay, imagine if we came through the side door like we were about to. I know, we were about to go to the side. Yeah, this miss, is way more exciting. Some, uh, this reminds me of the one from Halloween Town. Here we go. We already scoped out the rides we want to do, which is the there's, slide. There's three rides. Yeah, there's literally three here, so. Scoped out all three. Fifteen minutes for the slide. What lane are you gonna be in? Green one. Green one. I feel like I'll be I'll be yellow. The slides at fairs always scare me because the shock is so staticky. Like you're on carpet and there's metal. <gasps> All right, here we go, Ween. Okay. Uh, okay, I'm so scared. Ah, this is a lot scarier. Ready? There you go. Ready? Oh God. Two. I shocked you at the end, I'm sorry. I didn't feel it. <laughs> oh yeah, finally. Literally on every ride ever, I always fly out of my seat. Fly out? Not, not. Are you still with us? No, not like out of my seat, but like if, if it was a roller coaster and we went down, my butt would fly off the seat. I love how no one's in front of me. Oh, oh Jesus, Cal. Just kicked some wings. Are you ready for the sizzler? Do it, baby. Oh my god, we are first in line for the next one. I'm ready for the purple car. Okay, so we think 
that the purple, where are they at? Far. Far, on the other side, purple's the fastest. But we were not for sure, but we're gonna oh, go on for sure. sure. I thought the red was the fastest, but I don't know. morning it is Thursday the next day and I just thought I'd show you you know what I do throughout my week so I just did literally a full facial I did a cherry enzyme I did an antioxidant mask and then I did two serums eye cream moisturizer and I just put on my tinted SPF so my skin is so like supple right now and like Oh my god, I cannot wait to see what my skin looks like tomorrow since whenever I do my facials, it's like my skin looks like 10 times better the next day after like I sleep in it and stuff like that. I listened to two YouTube videos or watched them basically. I have my setup right here. Usually this is my towel tower basically. Oh, I love that. So I just watch like my vlogs. I love Kenzie Elizabeth and Keaton usually and then... This is the bathroom I get ready in. The lighting is so warm and it hurts your eyes after. So what I do is I purposely dim it down and then I close the door. And so I light a candle. Usually I'm so sorry that I have plastic in this video, but then I light a candle and it's usually just me, a podcast or YouTube video while I do my skincare routine because I have the vibes going on, the candle, and usually I have like a diffuser right here with like different neon colors. So then that'll be going. I have my video or podcast going on. But yeah, so this was my morning. I'm wearing literally the same shirt I did last night, but this time without a bra. So Yep, I'm wearing my Nike Pros and I probably will wear some sort of sneakers today and then my hair is on day two, I think, of, wa of not washing it. So I'll probably just do a ponytail and I don't know if I want to do any type of makeup right now because I just put my sunscreen on. I'll probably do a lip liner and lipstick or chapstick or something. Um, and my brows are freshly laminated. Come on, little camera focus. You know what, I'm gonna go out here to show you guys because they are so cute. I washed them out yesterday and the pigment's still in there a little bit, but I really, really, really like them. So yeah, they are super, super fluffy and thick. I just got a lash fill too, um, but I've yet to brush them up, so they're gonna look even better. Oh, and I'm also washing laundry right now since Ant's gonna be gone, and I will probably go back home for the weekend. And then also, I have a million errands to run. Like we're out of like basic things like soap and like cotton balls and that kind of stuff, so I'm probably gonna run to Target and do laundry and I really want to go grocery shopping but if I'm not going to be home for another couple days then it doesn't really make sense to go grocery shopping today so yeah okay so Anthony is bringing with him the box fan because the person that he's going to be bunking with snores like crazy so he has earplugs like uh -oh. the earbuds here we and go <laughs> Why am I so happy right now? I should be in tears that no. you're leaving. Anyways. All excited. What, what? This is his little carry-on. Actually, he's not flying anywhere now that I think about it, but he is gonna be gone and this suitcase is just, we love it. You don't even have to be flying. It's just good for like road trips and stuff because it has the little dividers. Anyways, this is not a sponsored video. So he's taking my brush, which is why I have to go to Target today to get a different brush. He's taking the cleanser, one of my favorite cleansers, toothpaste, and my skincare. He's so good with sunscreen, I'm so proud of him. He's taking the spray one, which is one of my favorites. Um, but yeah, this is his little suitcase for the next week. It feels like you're flying somewhere far every time I see the suitcase, but like, you're not. You're literally just driving up. That's but... what <laughs> Monkey butt. I love you. Me. I'll see you in a week, okay? Okay. I love you. Love you. Next, I'm making my infamous breakfast sandwiches. Just kidding, it's not infamous. So, I have the English muffin. This was the last English muffin I had, so I'm so happy. We have some strawberry jelly, some shredded cheddar cheese, and this, you guys, is such a staple. It's everything but the bagel seasoning, so I highly recommend you guys getting it at TJ's. Oh, do not vlog. While cooking, you guys. Okay, so those are cooking. That's the destroyed one. But lately, what I've been doing is putting the cheese on the bottom first, which is kind of gross because it's like, ew, why would I put cheese on strawberry jelly? 
but when you put the egg on it, it actually melts the cheese versus if you were to put the egg on top of here and then you sprinkle the cheese, make it look all nice, the cheese actually melts more and is just so much more delicious when you put it on top first. So I highly recommend doing that. Yes. Okay, and then I'm gonna take this glaze from Trader Joe's and just drizzle it on there. I know it's like so many different flavors going on at once, but I swear to you guys, these are like literally the best breakfast sandwiches that I've ever made before. And voila. So we have the glaze, everything but the bagel seasoning, shredded cheese, strawberry jelly, and two over easy eggs. But usually when you take your first bite, the yolk kind of drips down and it just kind of is nice because then the bread can soak up the yolk and it's so bomb. So those are my breakfast sandwiches that I've been making. So something that I've learned today is Pomodoro technique. So basically you work in chunks of 25 minutes and then you take five minutes rest. And I don't know what I'm doing with my pencil right here. I feel like I'm taking notes right here on the screen for you guys. So it's kind of like a mind shift. I open up the curtains. I can actually see outside the window now instead of being like all dark. But basically I'm just like tuned in to like the time of day, just being more mindful. And then when I'm done with these five minutes or even longer than that, that. however you need to like adjust that I'm gonna shift my focus back and start taking more notes and going back to learning so I feel like it's a good break that's my little update for the afternoon I'm just doing the Pomodoro technique and working in chunks and I'll probably do that until around 5 5 15 where I think I'm gonna go to workout class today and I really want to bike there since the weather looks so nice out and it's like not in the triple digits anymore here so I think I'm gonna do that for the rest of the day. Okay, so it is now like 5.15, like 5.20, and I have 10 minutes to get to my workout class. I'm on the wait list, so I don't know if I'm gonna get in or not. But either way, like I'm getting outside, I'm leaving this office, leaving this house. So yeah, you guys, I am back from my workout and I'm laying on all the clean laundry that I am going to be putting away later, but I'm just taking a little two second break because there's a lot of laundry and I should have been putting it away throughout the day, but I didn't. I got home from my workout class. I feel really good. I feel really like energized. And if I were to just go on my phone right now, I know myself, I'm literally gonna fall into a social media like rabbit hole and just like stay on the couch and be a potato all night. So I don't wanna do that. Instead, I took all the clean laundry from the laundry room and brought it here and now I'm just laying cause I'm vlogging, but Literally, I'm going to put this away tonight and be productive and then I have the debate on the TV just because I have that FOMO of like, oh my god, it's on, it's on, it's live, like you should be watching it. But then at the same time, I'm not super, super into, you know, following the debate. So, I don't know, I have it on the TV, so it's just playing in the background. I need to put the laundry away, I need to make dinner, and then if I can, maybe watch the debate and watch like an episode or two of one of my shows that I've been watching. But yeah, so this is the end of my day. I feel super productive, but I will be more productive as soon as I get up. Okay, so for dinner, I got into some hummus, tzatziki, some cream cheese, and salmon lox, and I literally just made a whole platter, which I just devoured, of like crackers with everything I just said. And then for seconds, I'm literally just eating the coconut cream, and we ran out of granola, so I'm gonna be eating some cereal on top of there, and maybe some manuka honey, I don't know, I feel like this is pretty sweet on its own. Welcome to another day in the life. Today is Friday. I leave tomorrow for California, but today I'm going to be doing a couple things. I don't like talking with this on, but you have to wear it in the gym. We're gonna be shooting, we, I mean me. I'm gonna be shooting my friend's content for her Instagram. She's a fitness trainer. There she is. <laughs> I'm gonna show people how to hip thrust. Yep, I mean. today we're doing hip thrust. We stole the little black cube from the gym area. So we're just gonna be shooting some content right now, and yeah. One of my favorite places ever. True Food. We got Johnny. He's running errands with me. And we are stopping off at True Food as our first stop. So I got the chopped salad and added shrimp as my protein. What did you get? <laughs> He's using a chew. Teriyaki. bowl. <laughs> Next stop is Home Depot. Oh yeah. Gotta get the sanitizer. <gasps> Christmas already. We live at Home Depot. We're always here getting stuff for the apartment. You guys, look what we found. It's the same one I was gonna get instead of lavender. They have an apple cider one, so I'm so happy. 
You guys, it is October. <laughs> Why? Look at the chipmunk talking. Oh my gosh, the chipmunk talks, you guys. Oh, look at the despicable guy. So cute. Hey, little guy. All right, next stop, we are at Target, and then hopefully get something sweet after. Target! You guys, Target is coming up with their candles. Like, literally, this one smells so good. Autumn leaves. These are all sweet. Are there more? So, we're looking for a throw blanket for the living room. Is it heavy? Uh, 15 pounds. I feel like that's heavy. The tranquility blankets. Uh, front, <gasps> oh, yeah, I need yeah. to touch you. <laughs> okay. Our couch is like brown, nudie. I'm my room right now. Oh, your room? Yeah. I'm throwing one of these on. I mean, I'm not sure if I'm in love with this material. This, I'm more of a this type of material girl. Like, this I can fall asleep to. So you guys, we are draining the ice bath because it is dirty and we just need a new way of like draining it. So we used to use the buckets, like orange buckets from Home Depot. But now we have this little guy. So this is the hose. Oh, I need to check in for my flight. Okay, so it's 7.15 right now. I leave tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. So I'm not even, I don't even have an alarm set. So that's where I'm at right now. My mom, literally, I cannot make this up, texted me right now. I know you guys can't really see, but she's like, did you check in for your flight yet? I'm not going in with you like this. If you guys only heard what she just said right now, she's changing. We're literally going and getting the bill and saying, okay, thank you for the to-go order. Okay, we're gonna go get some food because we're getting hangry. Waiting for our to-go order, but Erica doesn't want to sit inside. Sorry, I don't know why I have this mask on. I'm checking out right now. <laughs> Hello. When I was when I was vlogging, the guy literally was just like waiting to hand me the pill, <laughs> and he was waiting for me to finish the vlog. Okay, so we got some takeout. We had some sort of shrimp, and it came in like a lobster bisque, which is super salty but really bomb. We have burrata. We're watching The Bachelorette. Yeah. Um, and then we have gorgonzola mac and cheese, which is super cheesy. And that is our little meal for the night. So. Oh, also we have, oh wait, I forgot. The fries we put in the oven because they were super soggy. So if you guys ever get to go fries, just put them in the oven and they'll be nice and crispy. Hello, it's me, I'm back again. So Erica just left. I am literally like, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm packing right now for my trip. I am such a night packing person versus like waking up earlier and doing it in the morning. I'm just like so anxious. I like totally forgot how to fly again. You know what I mean? Like flying alone is so like scary, but at the same time it's not. Like, you know what I mean? Like I'm literally gonna roll out of bed, call an Uber and then go get picked up at the airport. So it's not that bad and I already have everything I need and if I don't, then I have it at home. So it's like, I'm not stressing. But please tell me why I'm doing this right now. I'm literally folding towels for this just so I don't have to do it when I get back. Like, why is that a priority right now? When really I should be focusing on zipping this up and putting it by the doorway. And then I also have these I need to put on. So I literally did laundry today for our bedding. And so right now I really should be doing that. I still need a shower, but honestly, I think I'm gonna skip the shower because clearly I have better things to do right now, which is fold this. So. Life update, you guys. I almost missed my flight because of TikTok. Like literally, they called all the gates, and I looked up, and like everyone was gone. And there were just like two pilots in line. And I was like, "Did you finish boarding?" And he's like, "Yeah, are you on this flight?" And I was like, "Yeah, I've been sitting here this whole time." And I literally did not hear him call my like number. the last person on the plane to get on and I was the last person off normally I like vlog like landing and everything but like <laughs> I literally just like woke up right when we hit the ground I was like so startled I was so freaked out I was like what's going on I thought we were crashing and I was like oh my god 
but um, landed. It's cold here. Just waiting for my mom to pick me up, so. There's literally nobody here, I love it. But also, it's not open yet. It's literally 9.45. When's the last time you went to the mall at 9.45? Never. When it opens at 10. Never. <laughs> oh my god, wait, Sephora. It's completely empty. Oh my god, that's what like to have no people around the mall. Wait, there's a Morphe right next to Sephora. That's kind of, it's kind of cool. Ah. <laughs> my mom literally just threw my pur her purse at me. <laughs> Because we're not supposed to be trying on. Those are so cute. Oh my gosh, those look so good. The cool thing about me and my mom is that we have the same shoe size, so. Oh, top five. Like, yeah. So if you like them, mom, I think you should get them. You guys, they opened up this new part of the mall, and it is so, like, I don't know. I feel like I'm at an airport again. Like, it's so big. How about this for wine, juicy, milkfish? Oh my god. <laughs> Lumberjack. Lumberjack. <laughs> Okay, so we left the mall, now we're at the row. I'm trying to go to Lulu. Yeah, they want a small one. I was like, mom, fill this. She goes, hi, who are you? Hello to you. Hello to you, soft little bra. Yep. How soft this bad boy is. It's so soft. I was just saying like how it feels like really like European out here. Mm -hmm. How like, now that everything in California is like, Outside only. So cute. We're in this little tent thingy. Ah, uh, she's she's hungry. I know. I just take the mask off. Oh. Right on. That's what happens when masks and makeup all over them. I know, especially with these ones, the disposable ones. Like you get makeup all in these. Yeah. So this is 2020. They give you a, a menu list menu. I don't even know what to call this, but the scanning things. So I'm literally just on the website right now about to order something she dropped off sauce but like no chips okay so i got a salad i think that's avocado i don't know what it's wrapped in but we got a little extra sauce how cute is this little thing it's good mama got what did she get just tacos pork tacos and a mojito we got three tacos three tacos you guys, look at how cute this is. I want it. It's also a charcuterie board, so you can put like all the snacks on there too. And it literally looks like the coast. So cute. These are cute too. Merlot and Chardonnay soap. Oh, look how cute this is. <laughs> this is one of my favorite stores ever, you guys. 100% pure because it's 100% pure. Hi, my angel. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, there's my dad. <laughs> <laughs> You're so cute. Say hi to the camera. We're vlogging together. Oh, give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. Okay. Okay. Mom! You guys, my mom got flowers. Look how pretty they are. Buster's just chilling out here. What's up? What's up? Watch. Shake paw. Oh, you're such a good boy. You still know how to do that? Me and my mom are doing a try on haul from our little mall trip today. This lighting makes me look so good right now. We literally both got the same jeans from Zara, but uh, mine are a little bit lighter. Hers are a little bit darker, and the ankles are kind of different. different. Yeah. But I love them. You can never go wrong with a pair of skinny jeans. Oop, oop. Okay, so homemade dinner tonight. Mom made, what kind of raviolis are these? Um, butternut squash. Butternut squash raviolis. And then also we have a Caesar salad. And I just threw some berries on here for color and taste. And for dessert, we're having Tiavana peach tranquility tea. I've never had this before, but it smells like the peach rings, like the candy peach rings. So I'm really excited to try it. Okay, and this is my outfit of the day. I have these little beach pants I got from H&M. I think we're going to the beach today. I'm not sure, but either way, they're super cozy and comfy. Then I have my little sweater I got from Zara. It's already filled with my dog's hair. And then a cute little shirt and then the bras underneath it um, from Urban. And then I don't know where this is from. I'm gonna assume PacSun because I always get like scrunchies from there. And then these shoes are from Windsor. And this is my little OOTD for Sunday. And I'm so excited because I'm gonna go watch church right now. 
your outlines. If you've not yet downloaded our app, please download Woo! I'm a little late. I was in the shower, but it is 11.26 and it started at 11, so we missed worship songs, but yeah, mom's making breakfast, so I thought I'd bring it down here so we can watch it together. I love taking notes. I gotta get a notepad and paper right now. Well, she made breakfast. Look at this. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. She made eggs benny, potatoes, and berries. Looks so good. Ooh, baby. Oh my god, these mirrors are so tiny. Anyways, okay, so this is my outfit. I thought I'd be super cute and trendy and tuck the sweater in. Unfortunately, it's not as flattering in the butt area since it's all like gathered back here. But uh, we're just gonna ignore that. Um, I feel like a little fashion Instagram blogger person right now with it being tucked in. My hair is clipped back, I have some hoops on. My brows are super, super fluffy and I also did some faux frax today. What do we think about this? I just did skincare and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do my brows, even though it's still early with you know, my brow lamination, like you don't need to fill them in. But I'm like, you know what? Let's do it. Let's fill them in while they still have pigment in them. So I filled them in and yeah, I really like them. You ever just have like a favorite brow? Like this one today is my favorite brow. Like look at it, it's just all the hairs are in one direction. Um, so anyways, my mom and I are gonna go to the beach today with my dog and then meet up with my sister. She just moved in to her first ever new apartment. So hopefully we're gonna meet up. She says she's studying today. So I remember how that was, how it's like, you know, if you're studying, you're like committed and you can't really make any other plans. Um, I don't know how she is with the way she studies, if she's like, you know, like studying for an exam or something, or if she's just studying to like get stuff done or like be ahead. So I don't really know. All I know is I'm really excited to get the house. It's really nice out. You don't really need a sweater right now. It's like 70 ish, like in the seventies right now, but then like the temperature drops here in California, like at nighttime. So I don't know. I just thought it'd be a little early and wear the sweater and um, yeah. Trying to guess the ingredients that my mom made. Mixed fruit from Costco, mm -hmm. um, peaches, strawberries, and pineapple. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah, just those three fruits. A whole ginger shot and oh, dang. Um, orange juice, ice, and a key lime yogurt. And we have Buster Boy back here. He is so tired. <laughs> to Santa Cruz and we are gonna go see my sister I haven't seen her I don't know in a month or so I'm not sure whenever the last time I was home is when I saw her so I'm really excited she's a big college student now I mean she's been in college but like she's moved out right now and I'm really excited can't wait to see her ah! everyone this is my sister my baby sister oh. she's so cool now look at her she's hey. so cool look at her we got the whole family, minus my dad, because he's in the golf tournament today. Buster's so excited right now. So we're walking over to this lighthouse, because it looks super cute, and then we're gonna go probably eat on the wharf. to eat so we had to put the mask on and guess who's coming with us buster look at him he's our guest of honor yeah sure <laughs> oh yeah baby yep so we got some calamari and a dozen oysters oh yeah Ooh, i got the seafood fettuccine has a bunch of seafood in it <laughs> <laughs> what did you get? Oh, you got the risotto. Mm -hmm. Risotto. Mom got some scallops. This looks so good. And then we have a sunset view right now. 